Hey, hey everyone, welcome, welcome back, back to Five and Eats, and today we have another little candy bar review for you. And so today we have the Kit Kat Birthday Cake Crisp Wafers in Birthday Cake Flavored Cream with Sprinkles. So Kit Kat is a brand that you will find all over the world, mm -hmm. and they will have some unique ones. We've done some in the past, yeah. and so this is long overdue. Yes. Birthday Cake, because remember it was like, I don't know how many years ago, it was like the, the Rage. Oh yes, that and, was like the flavor. Yeah, it was the flavor. And some of it's good. Yeah, you know? some of it is good. I do love the, the birthday cake flavor if it's done well. Now on a Kit Kat, I don't know how um, it's gonna be better than an original because I like a original Kit Kat and everything I've tried um, that's like a deviation has never been that good. I agree. The original Kit Kat, the, the flavor combo is just yeah. something that you can't, you can't get that with any of these other iterations. And guys, if you're new to our channel, basically we review everyday grocery items. So before you spend your hard earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. Now, it does just smell like frosting, basically. Yeah. Like a buttercream frosting. It doesn't smell really like anything. Like sugary, yeah, basically, just sugary, right? Yeah. yeah. Let's go for it. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right, guys, welcome back to our rating system. Thumbs up right again, thumbs down, we would not. So for me, this is a thumbs down. Look, I like the original Kit Kat. This one. It's all right, it's actually not bad. Like if you bought it and you offered me one, I would try a little bit of it. <laughs> um, thing is, this when you like first bite into it, I feel like there's a delay before you actually taste the, the birthday cake. <laughs> um, and then when you do, it's good. It's not like amazing. My favorite part was the sprinkles. <laughs> yeah, I like that. <laughs> But otherwise, like, what is this, like a white chocolate or something? Yeah. I didn't really care for it. Huh. Yeah. Um, I'm not really big on the white chocolate. Um, and so I just think it's all right. Now, is it birthday cake? Yeah, it is. I, a little bit, but it's not like a wow. Mm. Enough to make me buy it again. Thumbs down. If you like what we're doing here, please consider sending us super thanks. It helps us continue to provide more amazing content. Okay. For me, this one is going to be a thumbs down. I am disgusted by this. I I hate everything about it. You know, that's so funny because I don't hate it, <laughs> but I don't love it. You know, like I yeah. said, like if you bought this, I would uh -huh. I would eat it. I don't hate it. I, know, that's I was really... thinking I would never buy this again, this so is, you don't have to wow, worry about this is, it. This is a shocker. Yeah, because, you know, I was skeptical, but I was hopeful, and all of my hopes and dreams were dashed because this thing, number one, I feel like the, maybe the, the main issue in terms of marketing here is that, does it taste like birthday cake? Kind of in the way that just plain frosting tastes like birthday cake. Um, but I feel like the interior, which is the wafers yeah. and like that kind of chocolatey cream that's in between them, it doesn't go with the flavor of the white chocolate birthday cake around it. It's like a weird flavor combination. Then you have that white chocolate itself, which I don't particularly love white chocolate. Sometimes it's okay. This time it's not though. It is very waxy. It is the kind of thing that like leaves like a little bit of a film. Did you have the same problem as me? I was going to tell okay. you that the reason I feel like why you had the problem of the delay in flavor is because that this is nothing more than glorified sugared wax yeah. for the most part. So okay. uh, like, you're, you're basically having to like, your tongue is like melting the, the waxes of this basically, and then it's releasing the flavor. It's, it's not a good experience to eat. It's not a good flavor. And these f***ing sprinkles, I hate these sprinkles. I, I, I hate can't believe these it. Sprinkles. I can't believe it. Dude, I'm so annoyed because you know, like, yeah, the, the cake, it does kind of look like it has the round sprinkles. However, the package itself has the rectangular, like oblong sprinkles. This is those little round ball sprinkles that are crunchy. I think those are the devil sprinkle. I think they're the worst thing ever. Wow, oh wow. That is a lot of hate. If the devil parties in hell, that's the sprinkle he uses on his cake. The devil's cake is uh, <laughs> made by Hershey's. <laughs> 
what? To sum it up, thumbs down, thumbs down. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.